the Iglesia Ni Cristo, Church of Christ, has become well known for constructing strong, disaster-resilient houses of worship, especially in the Philippines, where natural disasters like typhoons, earthquakes, and floods are common. Here's how INC manages to achieve this. 1. Engineering and Architectural Expertise INC employs a team of skilled engineers, architects, and structural experts who focus on designing churches that can withstand extreme weather conditions. They follow strict building codes and often exceed the minimum requirements to ensure durability. 2. Materials and Construction Techniques High-quality materials are used, such as reinforced concrete, steel, and specialized roofing systems, to ensure that the buildings can resist strong winds, heavy rains, and seismic activity. These materials are selected to withstand long-term wear and tear from the environment. 3. Flood-Resistant Design Many INC churches in flood-prone areas are built on elevated platforms or stilts, ensuring that water will not easily enter the structure. Drainage systems are also incorporated into the design to prevent water buildup around the church. Fourth, wind-resistant features. Roof designs of INC churches are engineered to minimize the impact of strong winds. Roofs are often made of heavy materials and secured with strong trusses and fastenings to prevent them from being blown away during typhoons or hurricanes. 5. Earthquake-proof structures The Philippines is located along the Pacific Ring of Fire, making earthquake-resilient structures essential. INC buildings incorporate earthquake-resistant technology, such as flexible foundations and reinforcement systems, allowing the buildings to absorb and distribute seismic forces. Sixth, modular and standardized designs. The INC has developed standardized designs for its chapels, especially those in disaster-prone regions. This ensures that the construction process is consistent and follows the same structural integrity across all projects, making the buildings easier to replicate and maintain. 7. Maintenance and Upgrades Regular maintenance and updates are carried out on existing houses of worship to ensure their continued structural integrity. This includes reinforcing older buildings to meet newer disaster-resistant standards and conducting inspections after major natural events. 8. Strategic Location Planning When building new churches, the INC carefully selects locations that are less prone to natural disasters when possible. For areas that are inherently risky, Special adjustments in design and construction are made to account for local hazards. 9. Community Shelters Many INC houses of worship serve a dual purpose as evacuation centers during disasters. Because of their solid construction, they are safe places for the community to gather during typhoons, earthquakes and floods. The buildings are often equipped with facilities to provide temporary shelter for those displaced. 10. Strong Leadership and Organization The INC's centralized and efficient leadership structure ensures that all houses of worship are built with a unified vision and standard. This strong organizational system enables swift decision-making and funding allocation especially when upgrading or building new resilient churches. By employing advanced engineering, prioritizing quality materials, and adhering to strict construction standards, the Iglesia Ni Cristo Church of Christ has successfully built strong, disaster-resilient houses of worship that not only serve spiritual needs but also offer refuge in times of crisis.